Hi everybody, it's Lee of CJ Drill. Now I gotta tell you this, this keyed doorknob, it's the main door to the house and it's really been grabbing the key. It hasn't been going in very smoothly for one, it takes a lot of effort and it takes more effort to pull it out. And it shouldn't. Now, it came out this time, but there have been occasions when the key's gone in the lock and it couldn't be retrieved, okay? And, well, this is like one of those times. Okay. Now, this is a spray lubricant here. And there may be a temptation to use a product like this that is petroleum-based. And what i got to tell you is don't do it. Because what happens is you get any kind of oil or olive oil or uh, petroleum-based oil or water inside a lock and it's going to gum up the workings. i got to tell you that oil attracts dirt like a magnet. And it may, it may work the first day or two. But then after that, you're going to have more problems than you started off with. So the solution to a key that gets stuck in the lock is graphite. And a pencil lead is made of graphite. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just scribble here a little bit because I want you to see this, okay? Now, graphite is very, very shiny. I don't know if you can see it on a piece of paper, but look at my finger here. It's shiny and slick. So graphite like what's in the pencil lead, is the best lubricant for the interior of a lock. In fact, they sell graphite in a powder form in a hardware store. But let's say you don't have, you know, graphite around the house. Well, believe it or not, we're going to use a pencil to lubricate our key and our lock. Let me show you how to do this. Now, I'm going to take this pencil and I'm going to draw on top of this key as heavy as I possibly can and when I get a nice amount of graphite on there I'm going to turn it on its side okay and I'm going to get the edges as well the more you can put on the more effective it will be okay so there we go see that graphite powder sitting on the surface of the key well that should do it but if it doesn't, we may have to do it one more time. So let's go over to the lock and insert the key and see what happens. Okay, let's give it a shot. Now what I want to say is you want to shake it a little bit because you want to distribute it in the lock. Let it reach the tumblers, right? So we're going to turn it. Okay, so what I will tell you is it's a lot better is it perfect? It's not. It probably could use more graphite inside this lock. Now, ideally, this is what you want to use. It's powdered graphite lubricant. comes in a bottle. I'm going to open it up here so that you can see what it looks like. I'm going to just squirt it out a little bit. So this is really a fine powder, as you can see. Okay? So let's put this to work. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to keep in mind that graphite is a form of carbon, so it's black and it gets dirty. So just keep that in mind when you're inserting it and you're spraying it, because there's going to be black dust uh, that comes out of the lock, all right? Now, before we get started, I just want to say this. Make certain that your key isn't bent, because all the lubricant in the world isn't going to change a bent key, okay? Okay, we're going to insert that right into the keyhole and give it a good squirt. Let's do that again because I see so coming out. There we go. Okay, let's insert our key now. There we go. We want to distribute it a little bit in there, jiggle that key up so it really reaches the tumblers. I'm going to turn it like that. Now I'm going to try pulling it out and inserting it. Now that's how you fix a sticky lock. This is Leah saying you can do this. See you next time.